Hello again, YS community. This is Sarah Rodenberg with another Brain Break activity. For today's Brain Break, we're going to explore doodling as a brain break. And once again, my trusty assistant is here to help me. So today we're talking about doodling as a brain break strategy. Doodling actually is a great midbrain activity. So our midbrain helps with our motor movements, in this case our small motor movements. So to doodle, you could grab a coloring book that you might have in your house. You could just find a blank piece of paper and doodle on that. Or in Heidi's case, my trusty assistant here, she has decided to doodle on a whiteboard and use lots of colored markers to do her doodling. So I'm gonna turn it over to Heidi for her to explain what she decided to doodle when she left her screen for a few moments to take a minute or two to do a doodle. This is what came to her mind. Hi everybody, so I do this roots and wings picture because I drew it on a whiteboard because if I messed up you know what would happen I have to waste paper and why I draw this today is that my mom teaches roots and wings and it was like right on the top of my brain the first thing I thought of and you can put detail in it and make it look real and I love it because I just I was thinking, what does the roots and wings picture look like? And um, I, you have to like imagine that you're standing right in front of it, and that's how you do it. And you can like write how it's like. I wrote awesome. And yeah, bye everybody. So there you have it, wise words from Heidi. It's just that simple. Whatever pops into your brain can make a quick doodle. Take a minute, take two. It's a just a quick way to refocus your attention um, from academic things and screen time. So thanks for watching. Bye, everybody.